Well, I'm Tony Terry, and I play the role of Eric Brown. I'm a partner in a law firm, and it just so happens that my character happens to be a little bit arrogant. Now, that's a far stretch from who I really am, but, uh, you know, we're, we're going to test my acting chops to see if I can pull it off. <laughs> well, you know, I, what people don't know about me is that my career started in theater. So for me, this is like uh, going back home, if you will. Every opportunity that I get to do a piece that um, is important or that I feel like is important and, and that has a voice and that speaks to the people, I'd like to try to be a part of it. And I was fortunate enough to be, to call, to be called and asked to participate in this. And uh, I said yes right away. Well, as I said earlier, uh, my fans can, ex can expect a little uh, a departure from my normal character, and that is, you know, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Everybody has a little bit of arrogance in them, no. But this character is, is a, a little over the top with his arrogance, and I think what I think is really important about what people are going to see in this show is that I think that uh, I like to call this kind of theater slice of life theater, and I think that people, um, when watching it, will see people that they know, if not themselves even. Oh, man. Well, I have two new projects coming on two different labels. Um, both have singles out right now. Um, we, we just shot videos for both projects last week. And uh, it's really interesting that, uh, that I have two albums out on two different labels. But that's, that's the way the universe planned it, I suppose. It just so happens that they're coming out at the same time. I'm really excited about it. I've been working on the albums for about two and a half years now. Uh, and finally they're done and coming out and I just can't wait. It's been so long since I've had a record out. I can't wait for my fans um, to, to listen. <laughs> it's about, um, you know, even though I've not had any records charting, um, I've been in this business since 1982, a long time. And I've had uh, the fortune to travel around the world with greats like Roberta Flack Bo Bryson. I toured with Roberta for about six years. So even though I wasn't um, active on the radio, I was still working and traveling around the world. And I think that it's really about um, continuing the drive, even though, you know, I'm not in the limelight. I, as I said, I've been blessed to, to keep working and, and I don't take that for granted. Um, I have been and my wife currently is the uh, spokesperson for the National Fibromyalgia Association. My wife um, suffers from fibromyalgia and um, so we, we talk about the impact that it has on families, that it's had on our lives and uh, we let people know that the struggle is real and that, um, but God. I think people should come out and see when it all falls apart because um, uh, it, it runs the gambit of emotions from laughter to seriousness um, uh, and everything in between and uh, I think that uh, the words are powerful, the message is powerful, and as I said earlier, I, I look at this as a slice of life. So I think that people are going to relate to the reality of the circumstance, the reality of the situation, and see someone they may know, you know, the characters that they may know in, in this production. So we'll see. Great, thank you. Thank you.